Hey, I'm Justin, and this is another video in the live TD training series. Today we're on a carbonite, and we're looking at how to create a clean feed where you follow your main program feed unless you get to a specific source, such as a split, which is what we'll do, and we will take a full screen source on that clean feed instead. So it's already set up. You can see here I'm taking my cameras, but when I take ME1, uh, the split in mini ME1, my clean feed, it takes blue full. So let's go to our menus here. We're running version 13 on Carbonite. Um, we're gonna start by setting our follow. So we'll go to the live assist menu. From there, we'll select buses. And the first thing we're gonna do is set the uh, what the mini ME feed wants to follow. So in mini ME, we select mini ME1. And then for the background, we're going to select uh, a ME follow and we're selecting ME2 background. So that will make uh, mini ME1, as you see, is following everything that program does. Now, the second part of this is going to your configuration menu and then navigating to substitution. We've already got it in here, but we'll do it again. So we'll do a new ME substitution. The source we want to replace is where our split screen is, so ME1. And then we're doing it on mini ME1, which is our clean feed destination. And then the, what we will replace it with is blue. And I'll save that, and it's there again. So anytime I select ME1, it's going to show the split on program, but it's going to show blue um, in our clean feed. That's it. 